first encounter of a cicada kind. Found a honey hole. Oh, net full. The brood 10 cicadas emerge from the ground every 17 years in the mid-Atlantic east coast region of the United States. The last time we saw them was 2004, one year before YouTube, three years before the iPhone, and three seasons into Captain CJ's crabbing career. They swarm in the billions to mate. Doing so ensures predators can't eat them all. But what do cicadas have to do with crabbing? Science is at work trying to figure out how the timing of the cycle affects their predators, birds being the main one. But reptiles, small mammals, and fish also feed on these red-eyed, glassy-winged creatures. So it begs the question, will crabs eat cicadas? Watermen in the Chesapeake fishing underwater lines typically use shrimp heads, clams, or LY. Trotliners also use chicken necks, bull lips, and eels all up until recently. Cicadas are thick today. It's all fun and games until you get attacked by cicadas while you're crabbing. The cicadas are at their peak emergence. We need an extra helper. <laughs> <laughs> they were all over the water, crazy. Like pots would come up, cicadas would be in them, hanging on and they'd go flying off. Pretty wild looking. Uh, they're gonna start laying their eggs and all now and supposedly the little ones will start dropping out of the trees, so. It's a mess. People been getting in car accidents and all kind of crazy stuff. So one of them neat deals you get to see every 17 years. Neat little creatures. Well, Jason forgot the bait on the truck today. Maybe I should try cicadas for bait. Hmm, maybe I'll try that one. So we're out here catching cicadas to try to make up some bait. Load them all over the water here floating. That's gonna save the day, I think. That's the bait pots with cicadas. I gotta harken back to my, my trout line of days. Got him! Build a back to head now. <laughs> I ain't never used bait like this before. It attacks you. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Woo! Terrible. Got them flying everywhere. On me or what? On my back? Where's that? Fly away. Yeah, baby. Just like dipping crab. Gotta be ready. They're thick, but they ain't that thick. You gotta, you gotta keep your eye out. Just like crab, you gotta keep them in the net. You can't let them get out. Big fan of the pink bait well net for catching cicadas. Works, uh, works really well. You get down, and if you drop it, it floats. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, he hit the wave, hit the wave, hit the wave. Good get him. Oh, here we go, two, two. Oh, this is both. <laughs> All right, go ahead and chuck that over, Thomas. Go ahead now, chuck that one over. Nice. All right, last row coming up. Oh, oh I got one. We got Jason on the dip now. I'm gonna run the boat, he's gonna dip. Here he comes, get ready. Nice, got that one. Any more? Oh, here's one, here's one, here's one. Get ready, get ready, can he reach it? Oh! Back up for this one. It ain't like trout line. You can back up. Get him! Oh! Here comes another one. <laughs> These suckers are hard to net. I guess if we had a longer net, maybe. Play it out. Couple more. Couple more, and we'll have enough bait for the day. Cicadas from heaven. I look for the top of the water, so just, just buzzing a little bit. That's your indicator. Got a hot area here, two right, right next to it. Oh, there's another one, three. We're on them now, we're thick, they're thick now. We found the honey hole, coming in hot. Let's get a boat, we need them. Running short. All right, where's the other one at? We had three here. Nice, good eye, good eye. Get him, all right. Tough to get out of the net. They got little graspers on them. We just came across a three pack here. Gotta try to get all three of them. We're gonna need it. We're working, dipping bait. We're just doing it all today. Make sure you use 
all the bait up right before the last pot. Poor guy, he just ate his legs off. How much bait we got left? We're all out of bait. Good thing we got some cicadas to use. All right. We'll see how it does. Go ahead. All right, hopefully. Catches a load. We'll know, we'll know what the hot bait is for the, for the summer. Well, we got a pot. We baited with cicadas. We're going to let it sit for a couple days, see how it does. If we catch anything, maybe it'll be the hot bait of the century. You never know. Or at least the hot bait of every 17 years. All right, here's the cicada pot. Hey, we caught a couple crabs. What the? Looks like a stranger crab. Look at that weird thing. It's like a whole pot full of stranger crabs. Look at that weird, weird, weird crabs. I don't know. I don't like them cicadas. Here she comes, the cicada pot. Holy crap! Holy cow! Look at that! There you go. Thank you, Joe. We missed that one. White bird. Here she comes, the cicada pot. Holy cow! Look at that! Oh my gosh, Jimmy boy! Woo! We're baiting every pot with cicadas. So the cicada pot did catch crabs. That's all I'm gonna say. We filmed three different alternate endings. And we want everybody to leave a comment on which ending you think was the true ending for the video. Let us know. If you got any other good ideas, leave them in the comments too. Different baits maybe, something we could try. We always love getting new ideas. So the cicada run is over for 2021. I wonder what things will look like in 2038 when we see them next. Be sure to pinch that like button and to check out our upcoming Crab and Fish Friday report to see the actual ending. Until Friday. Thanks everybody for watching.